It's the biggest dry Queensland has ever recorded. Almost 90% of the state is now drought declared, with areas in the southeast the latest to succumb to the lack of rain. David Chen has more. It's the first time vegetable grower Bill Ward has seen the bottom of his dam on his property near Miribra. We'd say there's uh, less than there's less than five megalitres there, and uh, normally we're running seventy to eighty thousand. It's the worst dry he's seen, and keeping crops alive is a battle. Mother Nature decides to have a crack at you. You're going to cop it. The summer's record heat and lack of rain have seen the Fraser Coast, North and South Burnett, Cherbourg, Gympie, Somerset and the rest of the Banana Shire Council added to drought declared areas. When you talk about 87% of the state being drought declared, uh, that is a record. Dams on the Sunshine Coast are so dry, water has had to be pumped from Brisbane. Our major drinking water storages combined still sit above that 70 per cent. So certainly for the foreseeable future, we'll be able to move uh, water uh, uh, up to the north coast. Across the state, it's the same story. Water levels at Townsville's Ross River Dam are currently at 17 per cent. Once it gets to 15, the council will be forced to pump water from the Burnican, and that will be a costly exercise. The Weather Bureau is predicting some short-term relief for parts of the southeast. So there's going to be some isolated showers and thunderstorms around in lots of parts, um, but the focus for the heaviest falls is going to be south of Fraser Island on the coastal fringe towards the end of the week. The drought declaration means producers will be given access to subsidies and fodder, but even if the entire state was drenched tomorrow, recovery will take years. It's very tough, uh, particularly as we haven't really had a proper break from the last drought. With only weeks left in the wet season, Bill Ward is hoping for some relief from Mother Nature to get through winter. David Chen, ABC News, Townsville.